Welcome to the video. In this video, I'm going to show you on how to remove the ads from applications. It works for most of the Android applications. So, for example, I have chosen speed test application here. So, I'll begin the test. We'll see how uh, advertisements are irritating. If you see here, there is an ad started popping up. This is still okay. However, once you complete the speed test, there will be another set of advertisement which is really annoying. Let's wait. <coughs> Sometimes it will not appear, so test again. And here you go. This type of advertisement is really annoying. So I'll tap on no thanks. Let me go to the Play Store. One moment. Search for APK extract. This is the one application I have already installed. Tap on open. It will take around 10 seconds usually. So search for your application. Here it is speed test. Speed. Yeah, here you go. You, see, you just have to tap here. And as you see, it is extracted to the path selected. Let's go to the computer. I have copied the recorded, uh, sorry, extracted app. So I have renamed it to speed test APK. And uh, I'm making use of two tools called APK tool and Another is Android multi tool. I'll tell you why two tools are required. So I'll make use of APK tool to extract the information. That is, uh, I call it as uh, decompile. All you need to do is just go here, type cmd, press enter. So command, pro command prompt will be open and it will be already set to your existing path. So remember that you need to copy paste APK tool only on desktop. Otherwise it is not going to work. So a link to the APK tool and Android multi tool is given in the description. You can download the latest versions of it. So command here is APK tool D and name of the application that is speed test dot apk this will decompile the application again it will take a couple of minutes uh, let's wait for a minute so you can easily observe the status here so once it is completed it will be uh, displaying c users whatever it is so there is a folder getting created at the speed test. This will contain all the information. So once it is complete, I will show you how to edit the application. It is still in progress. So it will take some time. Yes, it is done. It took around 5 to 7 minutes for me. So we will quickly go to speed test folder. So don't worry about any of these subfolders. You just have to right click on Android manifest file 
This is the file. Android manifest, XML file. Edit with Notepad++. So don't use Notepad. It is not that convenient to use for search and find and replace such kind of things. Yes, here you go. So all I, I do is I just search for the keywords ADS or advertisement. Like this. It will be usually ads. Do one thing. Find all in current document. So you'll get to see all the places where ads are present. Double click one by one and delete the lines. Yeah, here you go. It looks like uh, ads, ADS. So once you delete all these lines and save your file, so there won't be uh, any function or anything which is calling the advertisements. So this activity itself will be deleted. So I will be deleting all the lines one by one. Delete it. See here, two lines you can delete in one shot. Oh, let me search again. Find all in current document. <coughs> I have got two more lines here. Just delete and ensure that you are not disturbing the syntax of XML file. Delete the complete line, nothing else. deleted all the lines which reads advertisements so you can search in two ways ads will be common word so if you see here it says can't find ads so in some of the applications APK files it will be advertisements so let me search so we are good to go let's close it don't forget to save the file Close. So I'm back to this one. So we'll go to command prompt again. So command here is apk to d speed test. So ensure that you are not including speed test at apk. So you are dealing with speed test folder, not the apk file. So B stands for build. So it will take usually 10 minutes to complete. So let's wait for 10 minutes. Yes, it is done completely. As you can notice here, you will see dist destination folder. So new new application is created here. So it is not the end of process actually. I need to sign this application. So signing through APK tool is not that straightforward. So I'm making use of another tool called Android Multi Tool. So just have to paste here, launch the exe file. Select the file, last option, sign in. Select the file. Double click on speed test and tap on sign button. This is not, uh, this will not take long time, it will be done in a minute or two. Yes, we are done. So, all you need to do is go to signed APK folder, copy paste this speed test signed APK back to your mobile phone and just install that's all
let's, let's go to our mobile phone. Here you go. I have a speed test app here. I'm trying to install. Open next. Install. It will take a minute of time depending on the speed of the phone. Yes, let me open it. Let's say we begin the test. You can clearly see here missing ad activity with Android, some error message is there, so you are getting rid of ads for free. Let's wait for completion of the task. It usually pops up another set of advertisement at the end. We'll see if that happens or not here. Yes, there is no ad. So test again. Let me try again. Yes, no advertisements at all. So we got rid of ads by modding the app. It was very simple modding, just the Android manifest file. Yeah, that's all. Thanks. Thanks for watching the video.